Hello, in this video I want to show how to retrieve some data out of the output for a transition state search. So this is uh, the output opened with VI and after the usual information from Gaussian stars and first thing is it repeats the, the input it was given. So in this case was a transition state search without eigenvalue test done at the restricted open heart refoc with this uh, basis set. Plus there were a number of uh, extra constraints or anyway redundant coordinates were given. Here we can see charge multiplicity and the coordinates of the starting structure and afterwards it says here that these were the mod redundant inputs uh, that was extra extra red. So there are bonds 1 to 5 and 1 to 6 that are requested to be computed as um, numerical Hessian. So you can see it here. These are the initial parameters. And for this two coordinates, R4 and R5, that are respectively the bonds 1 to 5, 1 to 6, so the carbon chloride and carbon fluorine, and it's going to compute the numerical Hessian with this uh, given step. And then I start search for Sutter point, first order. And input again, distance matrix and coordinates and da da da. You can just go to the end. This is a, a calculation that went fine. In fact, we have the funny quote and then for the normal termination of Gaussian 09. Going up, we can see that says you can look for the keyword converged and we see that all four criteria for convergence were uh, met and in fact it says optimization completed and under you can see what are the optimized parameters in terms of for example bond lengths angles and the hydro and we have also the Cartesian coordinates for so various atoms and X, Y, Z. Plus again, distance matrix. Going a little bit more up, we can see here they are reported the eigenvalues computed for the approximate Hessian during this uh, optimization. This was step number 9 and uh, 33 are the default steps for an optimization of transition state with this number of atoms and among these eigenvalues there is a negative one which is good which is what we were looking for and the eigenvector corresponding to this negative eigenvalue is reported here in its uh, components for as uh, internal coordinates as, and as we can see the two major components are actually R5 and R4 which are the bonds that we actually were looking for the carbon chloride and carbon fluorine bond so apparently this is a good um, optimization for a transition state and it should be relative to the what we were looking for of course, the only way of uh, being sure of this is to perform frequency calculation on the optimized structure and verify that there is only one negative eigenvalue that is that means one um, imaginary frequency and its, it's eigenvector is relative to the movement that we envisioned.